Praise the Lord. Welcome to AIM. Guys, I just want to give you a little video of the pup poppers. Yep. They've eaten. They're playing. We have the cassava drying, so they thought it was good to go up there and get the cassava. They thought it was good to come and chew on. So I did um, cut some of this moringa. Well, I just broke it because um, this isn't going to stay here. I just broke the moringa branches and gave some to the mama that mama sheep that just gave birth. And um, yeah, I broke the sticks up for them to chew on and play with. They got their water over there. My husband cleaned out their little pen. So we've been pulling out their poop and then just putting a little dirt over there where they, the corner they chose to poop in. Yep. They seem to like the corn too. They like the corn. Look, they got the corn husk playing with it. Natural toys here on the mini farm for the puppers. So I thought I would pick up the camera. Oh, somebody decided to pick up the bowl and bring it here. I thought I would pick up the camera and let you guys see the poppers playing around. I haven't showed you that in a little while. So they love to play and explore and go and see the others. One of them usually comes up here to Gracie. There's Grace Grace. Looking at the puppers. So what we have going on here, chores have been done. Um, I still have to clean their house, their little house that they stay in at night. And I also put Gracie and Wisdom in there last night just because um, of the rain. Uh-oh, there they go for the broom. They gonna chew it? No. Okay, that's great. My husband is just um, cleaning the compound with the leaf blower we brought. Another thing we don't regret bringing. It's battery operated, so we just charge the battery up and use it. Yeah. Gracie is here. Subina is on the chain. PC girl is in her place. They're looking for some more food. They already ate. They already ate, but they want more. I've still been doing the eggshells to support their ears. They're still young, so, you know, their ears will stand up. They're still young. So as the ears were growing longer, you know, I was taking a little time for some of them to stand up. But some are okay. Wisdom is back there on his. Gracie is here. So when I put them in, Gracie pooped in her, her house. Uh-oh. They smell the food. They already ate, too. Guys, I actually measure their food to make sure they're getting enough. And then um, what I also do when I'm feeding the nine, I pull the bigger ones away a little bit uh, once it's getting low. <laughs> Look at the ear. <laughs> once it's getting low, so the smaller ones, I mean, they're all big, but the smaller ones, I let them eat make sure they can eat but they're tough even the smaller ones are tough they bully their way in there and don't let the big ones bully them around yep so that's what we got going on with the puppers see how they react to the the blower mm -hmm. well, they're not paying it any attention they're kind of used to it so that's part of raising pups. I mean, getting them socialized with other dogs and also, you know, not letting them be scared of every noise and stuff like that. So that's part of raising good, healthy, 
um, strong pups. Let's see them. They're going to the back now. Come on, pup pup. Let's go. Gracie, be a good girl. Be a good girl, Grace. Look, puppers. You want to come play back here? You can. There's the water. We're watering. <laughs> They're getting wet. We're watering the garden. Um, somebody spilled something over there. We'll clean her up. I saw a piece of food. <laughs> Wisdom, be a good boy. Come on, pup ups. You want to come and play? Let's come and play. Come on, pup ups. So I have a little stone right here that I sit on when we're out here with the animals. So that includes the pup ups. There they are. They like climbing on these stones. Climbing on my back. Wisdom, what? What? You're jealous. They're your puppers, Wisdom. Your pup-ups, Wisdom. You don't need nothing to do with them, sir. Nothing to do with them. Not a thing. Wisdom. Hey, boy. Wisdom. Wisdom. <laughs> Who's a good boy? Who's a good boy? Hmm? Who's a good boy? I'll pet you too, mister. I'll pet you too, sir. Sorry, sir. Huh? Mister, mister. You good boys? Come over here and sit. Can you sit? Good boy. Good boy. Yes, he's a good boy. He's a good boy. Uh, sorry, guys. I got the camera everywhere. Mister is pushing my hand around. <laughs> Be careful, Wisdom. Wisdom. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. The puppy's stuck. That's why we... Hey, hey, hey. Okay, Papa. Come on. Sorry. Sorry, Papa. Your daddy didn't mean it. He didn't even know. Wisdom, lay down. Lay down. Let's lay down. Lay down. Lay down. Good boy. So the puppers are just sniffing around where there's been digging going on. I should probably take them away from here so they don't get tangled up in the run. They're not used to the run. Come on, pup ups. Come on, puppies. Gracie's just excited watching them run. Be a good girl, Gracie. Be a good girl, Grace. There they go. Pop ups. Nine poppers. So we've had inquiries, but nobody has come forth um, to take any pups yet. So we still have seven boys and two girls. Yep. Sorry for the video, guys. I think some of it you don't really get to see. But, yep, that's what we're doing. I'm getting these, these sticks I cut for them. Well, broke for them to play with. <laughs> they like the corn. They have corn in their dog food, too, so. And since they like chewing, I like giving them natural things to chew on. So that's my thing. I like giving them something natural to chew on. And moringa sticks are good. Moringa sticks are good for them. Mm -hmm. Pop up. I guess cassava is probably not bad for them either. But 
we didn't bring the cassava for them. Hey. There they go, fighting. <laughs> Wrestling and carrying on. Hey, poppers, you're going in. Okay, let's scoot them away with this big, giant moringa stick. You see, they like cassava. Hey, pop up. Come on. The stick's not working like I want it to. I don't want to push them with it, really. I just... All right, time for them to go in because look at them, guys. Look at them. They like cassava. They like cassava. I'm going to have to trick them with the corn again. I tricked them with the corn earlier, and they came over to eat it. So I'll have to trick them with it again. I get a little corn and bring them down here and trick them with it so they'll come and think I'm giving them dog food. <laughs> but they did like the corn, though. And, you know, dog food has corn and stuff in it, too, so. Let's see if we can get them down here. Pop-ups! Puppies! Here they come. They do like it. Pop-up! All right, guys, I'm going to have to end the video because it looks like I'm going to have to put them in because now they're really... Oh, sorry, guys. Now they're really getting over there to the cassava, and that's not theirs. That's for the other animals. But I hope you enjoyed the video, and let us know if you need a pupper. Um, the website is aaimcs.com. It will be in the description. If you can't find it, leave me a comment, and I'll respond to your comment with the website. Go to the Contact Us page. Scroll down and find my husband's contact information, Maxwell Mensa. And you can discuss pricing and negotiating and all that good stuff. I know that the more you take, um, if you were to take all, the price would come down. If you were to take two, I think the price would still come down. So, you know, and we are in Ghana. So negotiate as you may. And, yeah. So you can also see the interactive map where you can zoom in and zoom out and see where we are. So you'll know where the puppies are located. And until next time, God bless you.